How's it going guys? Jared from Lethal Performance and the Tune Shop. We're here today at Lethal Performance Headquarters, sitting inside Project Goldmember, our 2018 Mustang GT. I'm gonna talk about the N-Gage device. We've got a bunch of uh, frequently asked questions that our customers ask, and we're gonna go over them one by one so I can help you out and show you how to do it. So the first thing we're gonna do is actually upload the factory file onto the device. Really easy to do. Once we've got the N-Gage plugged in and powered up, we're gonna follow a couple different steps here. One by one, gonna show you exactly how it's done. You're gonna go to tuning, scroll all the way down to read vehicle, click on Ford, gas, and then obviously the vehicle that it's for, in this case, the Mustang 5.0, and then hit the checkbox and follow the steps. And just like that, it's uploading. Okay, we've got the custom calibration back from the calibrator right now. It's loaded onto the device with the SD card. And I'm gonna show you how to actually follow the steps to tune the vehicle. I'm gonna go to tuning, load tune. I'm gonna scroll through here and pick out the most re you know, recent revision that you have for the vehicle. In this case, it's the R9. Hit the checkbox. Flash this tune, and there you have it. All right, so we've actually got the custom calibration flashed to the vehicle. The next step, a lot of people talk about, a lot of people are confused about, is data logging. It's very simple. Data logging basically helps the calibrator to see what's going on with the vehicle, make any changes that are needed, send you a revised tune which you can flash on the vehicle for better performance. So. To do data logging, there's already a configuration file on the device, on the SD card. We're going to go to Diagnostics, Data Logging, check on the configuration file. It's actually connecting to the vehicle right now and checking the signal. Then all you have to do is tap the screen right here. You see the yellow light blinking right there. It means it's data logging. You're going to click it one more time to stop data logging, and that's it. Now that we've data logged the vehicle, the data is stored on the SD card on the device. There's two ways of getting that information to your tuner. One of them is plugging the USB cord into the front of the device here, download that information onto your computer and send it off. The second way is pop the micro SD card out of the side of the device just like this, pull it out, we're gonna put it into the card reader, plug it into my computer and email it off, just like that. Okay, so we're back at uh, actually Christie's desk because my desk has a lot of inappropriate material on it that none of you guys want to see. So I've already plugged the SD card into the back of Christie's computer. I'm going to show you how to find those data log files. So we've already got the email set up to send to our calibrator. We're going to try to attach a file. Uh, we're going to go to Engage. And you'll see here there's actually a couple different things. We've got the configuration. That's the actual configuration file that the tuner sends to us that we use on the vehicle. You've got your custom tunes file, uh, the logs file, which are the data logs, uh, stock files as well. So in this case, we are using the logs file to go to our data logs. And the most recent one would be this log 0018. We're going to click on that, choose it, and it's now attached to the email we're going to send off to our tuner. Hopefully I've answered most of the frequently asked questions that our customers have regarding the N-Gage tuning, data logging, and pulling the stock file from the vehicle. If you guys have any other questions, you know where to reach us. Thanks. Let me get into it, all right? Let me feel, let me feel, let me feel. We've also got sending and receiving files. It's pretty easy. There's four fucking things. I mean, how can I be not that smart to do this, right? Okay, okay gosh. Here we're going to do. We're going to talk about this end gauge. I'm going to show you how to do this one by one. Simple as can be. Press the button, run it up. 
You got it. Hi, Pitch Eric here. We're talking about the egg gauge device. The uh, custom tuners that we use. Can speak. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we've custom tuned the vehicle, and the next step is going to be data logging. Now that we data log, we're going to go and send the stuff to our tuner. <laughs> All right, guys, now that we've data logged the vehicle, we're going to take the SD card out of it and send the information to our tuner. Like this. A USB, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Okay, guys, now we've got the data, we're going to send it to our tuner. So what you can do is plug it in the front and send it away. If you do, guys, Hopefully, I've cleared everything up for you guys about tuning a vehicle with the N-Gage device. Very simple steps to follow. I think I've made it pretty clear for everyone. Please call us if you have any questions. I'll be glad to assist you.